Hi guys, thanks for stopping by and watching my channel. I'm going to do a quick uh, collective haul video, just two different stores, and uh, first is from the Dollar Tree. So first things I got was, I'm going to try to make this video quick guys because lately they've been too long I think it's kind of drawn out and gets pretty boring for you guys and I'm apologizing for that. I got this, um, I know y'all have seen these a hundred times, I want to get another one, they're pretty nice. Um, the Wet n Wild, uh, this is a, a large concealer brush, and yeah, I got like the last one, I think they're pretty much out of them now at most of the Dollar Trees. Second, I got some Wet n Wild Mega Last uh, Navy Blue Marin, this is the Twist Up, uh, it's pretty self-explanatory, um, it's the eyeliner. I got an NYC in the pencil form and this is dark brown and it is a good color it looks more like raisin kind of which i really like because it brings out the green eye and yeah that's just the uh, nyc eyeliner pencil i decided to try these again i decided to give these another go maybe they won't get stuck to my glasses <laughs> after i put them on and i decided to get some more of these um eyelashes I have actually a virgin eyelash wear. I've never really actually worn these out for a long time or anything because, like I said, last time I tried, they came off, stuck to my glasses, and yeah. So I just gave up for a while, so I decided to purchase another pair for a dollar. And I will try these out and see if they do anything. It's the thing that stinks about having glasses is because eye shadow. You feel like it doesn't really matter because you can't really see it that much. And then the eyelashes and even my eyebrows. I mean, they're not on fleek. They've never been on fleek. And they will never probably ever be on fleek. That's just how it goes. My eyebrows are just kind of there. I do wax them and stuff like that. But there's nothing special about them. They're just kind of there. They're clean. And that's it. All right, guys. Enough about my eyebrows. Okay, next thing I got from the Dollar Tree is this Elf lip balm tint and it is I don't even know it was grapefruit something and I really like it it's been hauled a lot it's just this basic um you know lip balm tint and I think it's really pretty and for a dollar elf is a great brand so I got one of these I got these little terry cloth face washers when I don't use my uh Sonicare my Mia I like to have something to scrub my face with while I'm in the shower. It came with three. Here's two of them right now. And um, yeah, they're still not really rough. I like to have a rough feeling on my face. So I might just use them for dusting. That's a good idea. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. Because uh, yeah, I like to feel it, you know, getting it clean. Like, uh, you know what I mean? It's weird. So yeah, anyways, they're cute. And I'll still probably just use them for dusting. I just decided that right now. Okay, so I also got this Forever Glow Hawaiian Tropic. I got two of these. I like my Tarte self tanner, but that's almost gone, and I need to get one of the big ones again anyhow. So in the meantime, why not try a Hawaiian Tropic Forever Glow for a dollar at the Dollar Tree? Can't beat it. And um, yeah, so Hawaiian Tropic has been around for years, so you know it's not going to turn your skin green or anything like that. So yeah, I think I'm pretty safe with this. So yeah, I got that. And I got some other things, but I'm gonna probably do it on another vid because a lot of my last ones were kind of long. And I don't think people like to watch long videos when you're just hauling basics. So yeah, let me get on to something a little bit more exciting. Next is what I got from Marshalls. I repurchased uh, Elizabeth Arden Cream uh, 24 hour moisture this one right here is my empty and this is my brand new one it was only $14.99 compare it 30 and up brand new box of that it's uh, once again the Elizabeth Arden perpetual moisture hydrating cream great stuff I like to go back and forth between my facial routines and uh, moisturizers serums and whatnot so yeah can't beat it Great stuff, and let me know if y'all have tried this before. I love it. Elizabeth Arden. It smells really good, too, so 
Yep, got that. Brand new one. And then I got these sandals. Great sales, of course, at the places. And these cute Steve Madden sandals. In the back, they zip up. They look kind of like Gladiator in a way. They're really cute. They're stretchy right there. And these were only um, $9.99. Second so pair at $30 and up. They said Steve Madden, really cute, so I love these. Just really, really cute colors, and yeah, I got those. I got this Flourish brand, Flourish shirt. It's just like a regular black tank top, but it has embellishment sequins at the bottom, which I thought were really cute. So yeah, I got these, and this shirt was only $2.99. It said I got hair all over it. I shed so bad, guys. <laughs> Anyways, um, this guy was so cheap, and it's a regular 20 and up, and uh, it's really cute. So yeah, I got that. It has a little band on it. And last but not least, I got this adorable Roxy Quicksilver cover-up, if you will, for the beach. I love this brand. This guy was only $15. It said regular 40 and up, and that's so true because I love Ron John's. I live near Ron John's Surf Shop. And they have got all these clothes in there. Volcom, I love Volcom, Roxy, and uh, you know any of these surf brand clothes. And they're so expensive, but I mean I love them. So if I can get something that I see at Ron John's and then it's so cheap, I will definitely pick it up. So this is so cute. You can dress it up with um, wear your bathing suit, of course, under it, or you can put a jacket over it. And you know if you're a stylist, which I'm not. You can probably figure out a lot of cute ways to uh, do it. So yeah, it's got a little symbol right there where well, you probably can't see it. It's embellished into that. But anyways, yeah, I love this brand. Always have. Been wearing it for years. So yeah, guys, that's all I got. And um, thank you so much for watching. And um, thanks for uh, stopping by if you're a new uh subscriber. Thank you. And I'll see you guys soon. And uh, hopefully you're having a great week. Talk to y'all later. Bye.